What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Heat Seekers barbecue episode. In this video, we're making these. You don't want to miss this one. Let's go. Alright guys, voiceover Kieran coming back. So we're going to start with some jalapeno chilies and some habanero chilies. Now we're going to cut the ends off these. You can uh, hollow these out with a apple corer. Um, but that's not what I'm going to do here. I'm actually going to cut these in half. Straight down the center. Same with the habaneros. Now we want to remove as much of that membrane as we can. Now it's probably easier to do this with a spoon. For the habaneros, we're actually going to leave the centers in because we want as much spice as possible. Now in this bowl, I've got some cream cheese that's been out of the fridge for about an hour so it gets nice and soft. And I've mixed some of the Heat Seekers rub into the cream cheese. But you can use whatever rub you want. Any sort of barbecue rub or garlic or spices, it's really up to you. So you just mash it all down so it's well mixed in. You can grab a spoon. And the idea here is to fill each half of the chilies. And then we sort of stick them together. Now if you've chosen to core these with an apple corer, you can just stuff the cheese down the center. Fill up the habaneros as well. And again, stick them together. All right, so now for the outside of the armadillo egg, we're gonna take this beef sausage mince. This is just a Coles brand. Um, it's about $6 from the supermarket. But you can also take whole sausages, whatever flavored sausages you want, and slice them open and get the filling out of them and use that instead. Now this is quite sticky, so it's, it's quite a tricky process. We place a jalapeno straight in the middle, and then you just want to slowly work it all around. Same for the habaneros. Now at this point, it's a good thing to remember to keep your habaneros and your jalapenos separate, so you don't hand the wrong one to the wrong person. So we're using some raw cured bacon. We're going to wrap it around each one of the armadillo eggs the best we can. Now you can use as much or as little bacon as you like. I only had one tray for this video, so we just did what we could. The raw cured bacon is quite sticky, so and so is the sausage mince, so it makes it quite easy to wrap them around. And you don't really need to use a toothpick or anything to secure them in place. So now I'm just working each one to make sure it's all firmly secure. Now we've got the barbecue set up for indirect heat. We're going to put on a couple of chunks of cherry wood for the extra smoke flavor. We've got a foil tray under the middle just to catch any of the drippings because these will drip a lot of fat. I'm going to place them all on. Not too close to the heat because you don't want them to burn. You want them to cook as slow as possible. Now we'll come back and check those in about half an hour's time. And they are looking fabulous. So at this point, they'd been on for about 50 minutes and they are pretty much ready to go. All right, these guys are done. Now they were in there for not long at all, around about 50 minutes. They've got a really, really nice color. They smell amazing and they've all held together really, really well. So let me bring you in. We'll cut one in half and I'll give you a look. All right. Look at the color on that. Now this is one of the uh, jalapeno ones, so we'll cut that in half first. See how it looks. Woo. 
That looks so good. All right, let's uh, let's cut open one of the habaneros and see how they went. That's the inside of the habanero. That looks amazing. We'll let that cool before we start by tasting the jalapeno. Mm. That is phenomenal. A little bit of spice, a little bit of smoke flavor, and that bacon. Oh. Cream cheese tops it all off. It's a perfect little snack for a cold and wet day on the Gold Coast. These are amazing. Mm. Super quick. Super easy. Super cheap. I gotta say guys, I apologize for the lack of uh, content going on the channel over the last week. It's been a busy couple of weeks at Heat Seekers HQ. So from this week, we're back to our normal uh, Friday barbecue videos. And we'll try and fit a few hot sauce videos in there as well. All right, let's try this little goodness. This is the habanero. Still really hot. Mm. Now that is amazing. Habaneros just go so good in this sort of thing. If you were feeling uh, particularly spicy, you could uh, even chuck some of the super hots in there, a ghost or a uh, reaper. I don't know if you call them armadillo eggs then though. I think they would be, uh, they'd be more like dragon eggs. But this is amazing. All right, guys. You know the deal. Subscribe if you haven't. Like if you do. Tell your friends if you want to. I'm Kieran, and this has been another Heat Seekers Barbecue video. Thanks for watching.